Hello YouTube. I am Rohit from Discover Tele. In this video, I will brief you about Tele customization named Restrict Tax Invoice with Missing TIN Numbers. At many times, we have found that we issue tax invoices without putting in the TIN numbers, which is a legal requirement. So later on, it is a big problem for us. It creates a headache how to get the TIN numbers subsequently. In order to activate this customization, I will go to F11, Features, Add-on Features, Modify Billing Features, Yes, and here it is, Restrict TIN numbers in Tax Invoice to Yes. Now, I will go to the accounting, both accounting info, ledgers, alter, I'll check customer 1 and see if I have put in the TIN number. The TIN number is there. I'll check customer 2. TIN number is not there. So, again now I will see I have a sales and sales tax invoice. I will say that this is a tax invoice. Correct? No, sales tax invoice. By enabling tax invoice feature in the voucher type, Tally knows that this series is now a tax invoice. And having a TIN number of my customer is a mandatory requirement. I will go to accounting vouchers, F8, a normal sales invoice, or I want to have the sales tax invoice, I will choose customer 1. In customer 1, I have put in the 10 number. So there is no problem in my generating a bill. It comes out. Now again, I will choose customer 2. It says that the party TIN number is missing. When I put the TIN number in the customer 2 masters, it will allow me billing. I can now bill to customer 1 because the TIN number has been given to me. I put the TIN number in the customer master, ledger master. So in this way, I can only bill to those ledgers or those customers who in whose master I have entered the TIN number. This is very very important and good customization and helps me avoid the headaches which I created later on. I hope this customization will enhance your Tally experience. Do subscribe to our channel Discover Tally and comment below your views on this customization. Thank you and have a good day.